Let us move on to the first question in the next exercise. So which of the drawings from A to D show the following fractions? So let us consider the first bit. Now we need to identify which of the following drawings from A to D show 2 times of 1 by 5. So when we observe the drawing in the D bit, we observe that there are 2 circles out of which they are divided into 5 parts each and among the 5 parts, one part is shaded in the first circle and also in the second circle, out of the 5 parts, one part is shaded. Therefore, each circle represents a fraction 1 by 5. Since there are 2 circles, this can be represented as 2 times of 1 by 5. Therefore, the fraction 2 times of 1 by 5 that is equal to 2 by 5 is represented by the drawing D. Now let us move on to the second bit. Now we need to identify which of the following drawings identify the fraction 2 times of 1 by 2. So when we observe the drawing B, we understand that there are two rectangles and in the, the first rectangle is divided into two halves and also the second rectangle is divided into two halves. Both the rectangles have one half of the part shaded. So each rectangle represents 1 by 2. Since there are two rectangles, this represents 2 into 1 by 2, which is equal to 1. So the fraction 2 times of 1 by 2 is represented by the drawing B. So now let us move on to the third bit. Now we need to identify which of the following drawings represent the fraction 3 times of 2 by 3. When we closely observe the drawing in the A bit, we find 3 circles. Each circle is divided into 3 parts. And among the 3 parts, 2 parts are shaded in the first circle. And in the second circle also, 2 parts are shaded out of the 3 parts. And even in the third circle, 2 parts are shaded out of 3 parts. Therefore, each circle in the A bit represents a fraction 2 by 3. Since there are 3 circles, this represents 3 times of 2 by 3. Which is equal to 2 is represented by the drawing A. So now let us identify which of the following drawings represent the fraction 3 times of 1 by 4. Now let us observe the drawing in the C bit. There are 4 squares. Each square is divided into 4 parts. So in among the 4 parts, one part is shaded in each square. Therefore each square represents a fraction 1 by 4. Since there are since there are 3 squares, so this drawing represents 3 times of 1 by 4 which is equal to 3 by 4. Therefore, 3 times of 1 by 4 is represented by the drawing C.